So a couple of days ago, I told you guys I was going to make a video about a book. And I asked you to guess what book it was going to be. Well, none of you guessed it. Which shows how much you guys know me. Hmm? I... Yeah, you all guess books I haven't even read. What was that about? <laughs> anyway, Sarah made a video. Yeah, Sarah Reese Brennan. Made a video about 10 reasons why you should read Untold. But let's be honest, if you've read Unspoken, you cannot wait to get your hands up Untold. So I thought I would make a video with reasons of why to read Unspoken. There were 10, but the video was too long, so some reasons why you should read Unspoken. So this is for those of you guys who have not read Unspoken, which I don't know why, how can you even follow me and not have read Unspoken? I talk about it 24-7 all the time. Um... But also for those of you guys who have friends who haven't read Unspoken after your glowing recommendations, what's that about? If you are a Teen Wolf fan at all, you will love Unspoken. And not only that, you will be able to understand why there are so many gift sets and edits of the Teen Wolf cast with random quotes you've never heard in the show. Also, Sarah Reese Brand did some pretty amazing parodies for the season one of Teen Wolf, Sarah Wears the Rest. Um, so yeah, you should read those as well. <laughs> now from One Direction is Irish, and I know for a fact some of you guys like One Direction, and Sarah is Irish as well. So if you like One Direction, you will like Unspoken. Okay, accents. Unspoken is said in England, which means everybody except for, like, Jared, speaks, well, I mean, I guess Ash a little, speaks in an Amer- <laughs> speaks in a British accent. Think of the possibilities. You could read it to yourself in a British accent, you could read it out loud in a British accent and practice your accenting. You could buy the audiobook and have it read to you in an English, British accent. I cannot, why, I keep, why do I keep saying English? I don't know. Anyway, so many possibilities. So yes, accents, definitely a reason. Kemi is an amazing character. An amazing my character, an amazing character overall. She is the secondary character from every book that you wished the book was about. She's witty, and she's smart, and she's funny, and she has incredible fashion sense. A+. plus. Also, the other characters. Particularly Derek. What I like. Okay. This is one of the truest reasons I'm about to give you. Sarah Reese Brennan is evil. She's an evil genius, and we all need evil in our lives. And also, as a subset from that, pain. Pain. Unspoken has pain everywhere. There is suffering. You will suffer with the characters and with the villains and you will suffer through the book and in the happy moments and in the sad moments and you will suffer as you wait for the next book. I mean, not if you read it now because I'm told it's right there. It comes out tomorrow, you should buy it. Well, you will suffer every time Sarah Reese Brennan posts a sad snippet because it rips your heart out and every time she posts a happy snippet because you know that will not last. And then lastly, if you read Unspoken, and this is your first Sarah Reese Brennan book, then you can read Untold, which comes out tomorrow, and you can read all her other books. You can read The Demon's Lexicon, and you can read Teen Human, and she has so many short stories online, and basically you should read everything Sarah Reese Brennan writes, because she is funny, and awesome, and her books are great, and I need people to fangirl with me. So go get him.